Hi, my name is Chris Gilliatt, and I am the training manager for Fairlane Services and also the rep for Central Industries. Today we are going to be covering the wall mounted chemical dispensing control system. First off, whenever using the dispensing control system, you always should put on your safety glasses and gloves. Today, we will be covering how to use the dispenser control system. You have a water supply hooked up. It goes in directly to the dispenser. Whenever you want plain water, you have no chemical in there, you make sure your water is on, cold water preferably. When you want to fill up your bucket with just plain water, press the button and you can get water directly into your bucket. If you want to fill up a spray bottle, all you have to do, if you want plain water, is get this and put it right directly in for plain water. If you want just plain water, that is plain water coming out. Whenever using any type of product, you want to make sure that it's properly labeled, remove the safety cap. If it is a foil cap, make sure to remove any seal, and this is ready to be inserted. By inserting your peroxide cleaner, you can see it clicks directly in there. Filling up a uh, mop bucket, all I have to do is press this, and the chemical will come out properly, no matter what chemical choice you make. To release, press the button on the side. By wanting to get a spray bottle, all I have to do is make sure that any chemical I use, whether it be peroxide cleaner or glass cleaner, I want to make sure I have the proper label on the bottle, insert into the bottle side, press the button, and it will fill from the bottom to create no foam so you can fill the bottle directly to the top. The main reason we use chemical dispensing systems is if we're changing out our mop water frequently, where we need to do diluting and control with a lot of control over the employee or in the application we're trying to do. These are always measured at the proper dilution, so there is no reason to open a bottle and pour it into the mop bucket. We also want to make sure that it's diluted to label. Everything from the bucket side or the spray bottle side is diluted to label, just like this peroxide cleaner we put in there. We then insert our spray nozzle, and now we're ready for work. 